we're gonna use one of Bruce Lee's concepts, which he called progressive indirect attack. So basically what I wanna do is I wanna fake him out. That's all it is. I'm just faking him out, okay? So from out here, I'm gonna throw a finger jab at him. I have no intention of hitting him with this finger jab. I cannot hit him with a finger jab from here. But I need to get his attention. Sometimes we also refer to this as overloading the high line, okay? So I get him to think high, right? As I pull the hand back, I'm gonna use it like I'm, like I'm pulling a rope. So I'm gonna fake this, I'm gonna come back and kick him in the groin. Okay, so I just use you guys, you guys do that little pendulum shuffle, mm -hmm. right? That's all I'm doing here, to get that little kick into the groin. I'm taking the leg, so I accidentally hit him with the groin. If I accidentally hit him in the groin, it's okay, because he's in full uniform, which means he's wearing a cop. Good man, all right. So now, once I do this, I fake, I take the groin, I'm gonna poke him in the eye again. He doesn't want to get poked in the eye. So what's the, what was the natural reaction just right now? Mm -hmm. What do you do? Hand came up, right? What's that for us? High reference, High reference point, which takes us into our trapping, yes. Okay, so we're gonna fake it, we take the ground, we come in, to our pocket lock. We're gonna go back to our cross. Crunch, you might just want to not be there, brother. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so in here, we're gonna go to our pocket lock, go cross, slap, cross. From here, I'm gonna reach up, I'm gonna grab his head, and I'm gonna hit him with the knee. I'm gonna set him down, take a foot sweep, I'm gonna switch this around, foot sweep him again here. I'm gonna try to go to the knee mount. He's too sharp for that. This guy learned last time. He knows how to defeat octopus one. He's gonna get on his side instead. Oh, no good for me, right? Except for the fact that I just did the last seminar session, and I know there's an arm bar right there. <laughs> Can we do that? Yeah. And of course, we know that if we're using the mitts, we should at least practice taking that face out a little bit. I love hammer fists. Right? Hammer. Street miles. Let's do a couple slow, slow form a couple times. Okay. So, fake the eye. Go to the groin. Go for the eye again. He blocks me. Pop, lock, cross, slap, cross. Take the knee, inside foot sweep, outside foot sweep. He goes to stop this, it's out of the way, I fall. I'm gonna go under, step around. Go to the arm bar, one, two, three. Okay. Can we do this? Yeah. Any repeats? Fast or slow? Slow. Slow. <laughs> Fake the eye. Kick the groin. Go to the eye again. He blocks it. Go pock. Go lock. He steps back out of trapping range. I go cross. Slap. Cross. Grab the hair. Lead knee. Set it down inside. Take the inside foot sweep. He tries to stand up on me. I move this over here. I take the outside foot sweep. As I go to knee mount, he gets out of the way. I go underneath, tuck the head, step the foot, and try to put my shin on his ribs, which sets me up for the arm bar. 